Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. We're with you at the St. Jacob Park here in Basel, certainly one of the most aesthetically pleasing stadia in Europe. We stand for the national anthem of Switzerland. Switzerland lining up in what very much looks as though it's going to be a 5-3-2. Well, it's an attempt, Peter, to put a solid bedrock in place and negotiate the game from there. If they can absorb what comes towards their box in the early stages, then the midfield can begin looking for more of the possession and can start thinking about a more probing influence on the contest. It all depends on keeping their goal intact. So they won't have to open up and indulge in, in taking risks at the other end. And that gets things running. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Um, David De Gea, simply because of the remarkable strides he's made to earn the worldwide respect that now exists. From an insecure, hesitant spell, he's grown into a supremely confident and assured character. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. That always looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. Rodriguez. Thiago. Forward it goes. And it's Pablo Sarabia. Shakiri. Granit Xhaka. Finds himself eased off the ball. Gets away from his opponent. Xhaka. Just brushed off the ball there. Loose ball, who's going to get there? And it's played forward. There's a lot of movement going on. There's no shortage of options. So I guess they're looking to play around their opponents as opposed to through them. Yeah, the style is designed to dominate the ball, and so you dominate your opponents. And here's Mbolo. Now it's Seferovic. Rodriguez. And the finish! He's got away with one there. Well, it was just some wayward passing that let the opposition in then, and I have to say, a very lucky escape. You lose it there, you expect to be punished. Oh, good interception. Looking for space out wide. Gorgeous control there. Looking for a decent ball in. Got a shot away. Lacking in accuracy. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. Thiago. Koke tries to get it forward quickly. Well weighted. He's got it, and he, he's had a go! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. All he'll be thinking is, please, ground, swallow me up. And it's Morata. Chipped through. Dangerous looking ball. And it's come to nothing. Oh, 
Just needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Thiago. As Prequeta plays it forward. Shakiri. Uh, looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. And we have the first chance from a dead ball situation. He's shaping up to have a crack from here. Shakiri! of a goal and Switzerland take the lead dispatched expertly nicely done Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Ricardo Rodriguez. Shakiri. And the ball's come out. Shaka. Shoots. Ferran Torres can't get the better of his opposite number. Crunching tackle. I have to say that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. And it's Jordi Alba. Respinacueta. Switzerland are leading with half time drawing close. Koke has gone out. They can break here. Seferovic needed to come up with a better ball. Uh, it was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Koke. Koke drives it forward. And that is as far as they're going to go. It's on a ball oh, shooting chance! He has done it! Spain are all square! What a great finish, but how about the touch? It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Well, if anyone in this stadium thinks they haven't got value for money, I give up. Now it's Thiago. Pablo Sarabia. Rodriguez battles to win it back. He's got options out wide. That's Pablo Sarabia. Chance! Yeah, 
Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. It's going to be the final action of the first half. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. And we are up to the break. Well, Peter, I'm just thinking of the best way to describe that. Frantic, um, frenzied. It was unmissable and it was irresistible. Forget about the analysis on this one, just enjoy it. So we're already into the second period. Switzerland need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Mitch Rodriguez, and here's Seferovic. It's Seferovic! Oh, so close to what would have been a memorable goal. Well, he cut straight through the middle, only to find he had no cutting edge. Shaka, Shakiri, hoists it forward. Koke, Jordi Alba, Thiago, and it's Morata, Pablo Sarabia. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Raspilicueta, and it's played forward. Switzerland really looking to get back into this at the start of the second half. Thiago has created one goal already. Raspilicueta. Thiago. Switzerland really aren't helping themselves. They're not seeing enough of the ball. And here's Morata! Shakiri with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. Well, he can't say now that he hasn't been warned. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special delivery from the ref. And he's cut it out. Ferran Torres. He's gone down, but the referee just tells him to get back up again. The seats are in a good position. And it's Seferovic. As Pliqueta plays it forward. Koke. Ferran Torres. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? And here's Empolo. And helps available out wide. He gets past his man. 
As Plequeta is there to heave it away. And here's Shaka. Well read, he sorted that out. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. It's a promising run he's making on the right. He's got away. It's just incredible. I mean, who would have seen this? Neither manager, I think. It's all happening. That's no fluke. It's what he was there for. Our players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great coaching positions. How quick-minded was that? So all square and not for the first time. Well, that goal just serves to give them the momentum and psychological edge now at this stage, but for me, they've got to chase a winner. And here's Morata. Spain merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Morat. It's Morata! And it's Koke. Pablo Sarabia! Yeah, he's fouled in there. Koke! Crossbar comes to the rescue. And that's been levered clear. Oh, real danger here. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Has a pop! Oh, it's in! And that may just do it! And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. It was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Switzerland complete their comeback and now they only need to hold out for a few minutes Well look Peter, I feel I've got to stress that there's still time for another so we can't be too presumptuous yet Now it's Morata Oh, that's nice It's Morata! He's done very well to get to that Well as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade Seferovic, and that's it. Switzerland did it the hard way. A testament to their great powers of recovery. They have defied the odds. 
thrilling, nail-biting, perhaps frustrating until the very end, but we do have a winner. Well, this looked like it had a, a draw written all over it, Peter, so credit where it's due. They found a way to win it.